Hi! I never made a video like this before. So, the SFM comparing mentality. You know what? Scratch that. The mentality of comparing yourself to other people in general. I've been wanting to make a video talking about this for well over a year now. Even back when my poster still kinda looked... Yeah. Ever since I started making posters, I shared them online. You know, on one of those art sites. I don't have to explain myself. Anyway, even when I used Photoshop as a crutch, when I used Photoshop for a different type of editing style, people would always comment, Wow, your posters are so good! It makes me not even want to try anymore! And you spiraled me down into the darkest point of my life and it's all your fault! And I have two things to say to that. One, stop it. And two, you guys have low standards. No, but seriously, I think almost every artist, or even anyone who is skilled in some way, can relate to the whole people somehow getting unmotivated based on what said person does. It's much more common than what I used to think. Also, some people will tell you not to compare yourselves to others, and well, maybe that works for some people? I... it doesn't really work for me. I'll explain in a second, hold on. So, Stig, what do you think? Well, I'm glad you asked, viewer who sounds exactly like me. I was never really one of those people. Whenever I saw someone skillful in any regard, such as TF2, SFM, I didn't get discouraged by how good they were compared to me. Instead, I got excited that it is possible to be that good. When someone makes something or does something far superior to what I can do, that's what motivates me to push farther beyond my limit. To go alongside that, when it comes straight to strict comparing, my main goal isn't to improve past others necessarily. I mean, it's a nice bonus. It's to go past myself. Let's just sum it up here. I look at others to fuel my inspiration, and always try to beat myself in my own game. In other words, I'm competing against myself. I mean, I don't know if this mentality works for everyone. All I know is it's what I like doing, and I think you should do it. But what I do know is that people, especially inexperienced people, should not bring themselves down just because there's someone else better at something. Because that's always a thing, unless you're on the top, but people aren't